Hello, my name is Steve for Whip Fit Maui, and um, I've had a little coffee, flat white from Starbucks, and um, not product placement, and I've had a little time to uh, think about a few things, and this is something that I would like to address, the uh, controversy between spin and cycle and a road bike. All right, so... SPIN is a certified program under the guidelines of the Spinning Foundation, Association, whatever. When you take a SPIN class, unless it is of that kind, you're really taking a cycle class. What's the difference? The difference is what you do in it. In a SPIN class, the one that has that title to it, you stay in your bike, it's more traditional, it's not a lot of moving around, RPMs, things of that nature things that you would do on a road bike outside. Fine. What would you do in a cycle class? Everything that you don't do in a spin class. You can move around, you can get out of your seat, we do push-ups, I do other things like that as well, but that is not technically spinning and a lot of people think that that doesn't count as a spin class. It counts as something different. So, big deal. Well, the other thing is why compare them? You know, if you are in a spin class, cycle class, as it's supposed to be called, why not enjoy being in a cycle class? The idea that you have to do the same thing in a cycle class that happens on the road is ridiculous. Try to put a spin bike out on the road. What are you going to do at a stop sign? What are you going to do at a red light? It's not going to go anywhere. Again, and then if you want to take a road bike inside a classroom, that's going to go far. So why compare the two? You know, other different things are, I wouldn't recommend doing the stuff that I do in my class out on the road. We would look like crazy people and get arrested. But we're not out on the road. We're in a classroom. A classroom to have fun and to do that type of stuff. So if it's not correct movement, if it's not the idea of what spin should be, big deal. It's also not going to rain in a classroom. You're also not going to get hit by a car in a classroom. Just thoughts that come to my mind because I've seen a video going around lately about proper forms and proper ways to set yourself up and incorrect forms on a spin bike. Fine. I'll call it cycle. My class is actually called cycle zing. The place where I work, we don't have any spin classes. We have cycle classes because we aren't doing the spin program, the spinning program. And finally, you don't have to wear a helmet in a spin class or in a cycle class, excuse me. So, you know, Unless you want to come to a cycle class inside a gym with a helmet on, stop comparing them. I'm tired of it. Enjoy your coffee.